As part of efforts to augment government efforts to end illegal mining, which is taking a toll on the environment and water bodies in the country, the Kibbe Divisional Police Command on Thursday, acting on a tip-off, went on a swoop together with the Ochiman Environmental Tax Force at Asamantamfoy. According to sources, some illegal miners, including foreigners from neighboring countries, had besieged the Tamfoy community and with the assistance from some community members who were destroying farmlands in the area, all in the name of Galamse. The team navigated through the bushes, muddy and unmotorable roads to get to the site where the illegality was taking place. Upon seeing the team, the illegal miners, however, took to the bushes to avoid being arrested, but the team managed to arrest some after pursuing them in the bush. The Kibi Divisional Police Command, together with the Ochiman Environmental Tax Force in the Joint Operation, arrested 24 illegal miners at Asamantamfoy in the Etiwa East District of the Eastern Region. The team, led by the Divisional Police Commander, Chief Superintendent Magnus Randolph Sam, retrieved a pump action gun, two excavators, two motorcycles, one tricycle, and two pumping machines. The commander, who declined to speak to cameras, indicated that the police will pursue those who managed to escape and speed up processes to prosecute those who will be found culpable after the police concludes its investigations. Okuji Aman Apejafori, the chief of Chibia Papem and the leader of Ochiman Environmental Tax Force, spoke to City News after the operation. We have come here before to want them to stop what they are doing over here. Because this is illegal. They couldn't manage. In the second time that they came, they overpowered us. So we reported the matter to the Visa Commander. And the Commander is Commander Sam. So he mobilized his men to join the task force. So as you all see, we came here that they are doing illegal mining. We are able to retrieve two excavators, one pump action, some pumping machines, and we are able to arrest about 24 of them. When the team was making arrangements to get the machines towed to the Kibi Divisional Police Command, a gentleman who appeared from the community and indicated that he was the chairman of the miners in the area had the heated argument with the team. Are you part of it? I see. We are a community mind. We are a community mind. We are a community mind. We are a community We are a We are a We are a We the peaceful swoop, however, turned chaotic when the team got to the community. The youth of the area, together with some Galamseyers, blocked the road with an unregistered Honda Civic CRV to prevent the team from taking the excavator, which had been towed onto a low bed out of the community. The team had to fire several warning shots to disperse the crowd immediately after they started pelting them with stones from all angles. Hey, some vehicles got damaged in the process and the leader of the Ochiman Environmental Tax Force, Okuji Yamana Pejafori, was hit at the back of his head by some of the stones. He however indicated that the team will stop at nothing but ensure that the whole Achim Ebuakwa state is free from activities of illegal miners. It's a signal not only the people in Ashaman Tamfoy, uh, the whole Achim Ebuakwa boundaries belong to His Royal Majesty. So he said we should stop the illegal man. We've been doing our best all the time, but they are still doing it. So uh, it's a signal to everybody doing illegal. You don't know when it will come to your turn. So we are advising them to stop. So as you can see from the background, uh, these are freshly dug uh, holes by these illegal miners here at Asamantafoy. Now, uh, these 24 illegal miners who have today been apprehended 
uh, are definitely going to face the full rigors of the law. For City News, Neoni Amati Kanaku, Asaman Tampoi.